Hi guys, welcome back to another Total Terran Unleashed. And there's a update that was pushed out today that I'm pretty glad they put out. Uh, it's been a long time coming. Um, the salvage commons button. Uh, that took a while because, you know, if you're grinding for SP, you'll be there pressing and pressing and pressing. Um, so, the way it is, you have to be, right now, you have to be on a common itself. If you're on a rare or a epic, it goes away. You have to have a common out. You can hit Savage Commons, it tells you how much commons you have. You can double check, one, two, three, four, five, six... Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight level one common cards. Wait, one, two. Oh, it's probably a double of something. Yeah, okay, there it is. So, you hit that. It salvages everything. I go up to eight up here. Just waiting for that to come out. And what you notice is that it goes away as soon as you don't have any targets for it, right? Now, if I get a basic pack, it won't show the salvage commons button. I think there's a minimum to it where you have to have about five, at least five commons for it to show. Like right now, I'm on the common, it's not showing me the salvage commons button, right? So... What I'll do, I'll get the basic pack four. Get some stuff on here. And it's going to add towards the one I have. Give me the five. And then that will show up. But I'm really glad that they put it in. It's just, it's a big help. <laughs> it's a really big help. So, should be there now. Salvage commons. And um, one, two, three, four, five. I'll show you as soon as it goes underneath under one that button goes away doesn't come back so you need to have at least five commons in there um so hopefully that's helpful the other thing i wanted to bring up was the what i've been thinking about for counter measuring against uh, tempest citadel i am identifying evade and pierce as things I want to focus on on the next set of card, the next cards I start upgrading, um, the Pierce dodges jam, dodges strike. Sorry, the evade dodges Pierce, dodges strike, dodges weaken, which is something I've kind of overlooked. Um, run Baracus, it's good rainbow commander. If you are free to play, you tend to have. <laughs> you tend to play what they give you. Um, so right now, I only have Arc Nova, which I'm working on upgrading, um, and the Ogobor that has an evade on it. Everybody else is kind of just, you know, waiting to get picked apart. Um, the Taz, I don't mind as much because it has the self-heals. And it's cost one, so in a battle, if he gets jammed, then I'm not really that scared. If he gets hit, I'm really not that scared because he could heal himself pretty well. But this other guy, I've dropped Spiteful Raptor first. Normally, it's kind of my best opener um, because of the leech. It could heal itself, stay alive. But dropped against if if I put this out and someone drops a Tazareka against me, I get wrecked. He takes well, this is a Tazareka, I'm not even talking about if it was the quad, the Tazarius. I'll take at least, you know, five if they have a Baracus, it might be more, it could be seven. And then I go down to one, they're attacking, I go down to zero, they're attacking. So I've actually had my Raptor get wiped off the map before it could even get an attack in against a Tazareka. So, the... having some sort of evade is just getting... I'm, I'm recognizing it as being something that's more um, relevant to a lot of cards that are being played now. And the protect... 
Pierce is probably one of the best things against Protect right now. I wish there was more stuff, like maybe Poison. Um, the Corrosive is coming in really nicely too, but a lot of people have Jam or Weaken Effects. And they kind of come, they kind of conflict against each other. They don't, they don't synergize that well just yet. But you know, it's um, it's a measure that keeps you from dying. So I'll need to experiment with some more um, corrosive cards. I hadn't really seen something that was uh, free to play that really caught my attention. But I think I'll try the um, Nightcrawler. That's the event, the third leg of the Infested Worship event. I'll try that on out. But, you know, I need to get some other cards out first. Um, another card I'm kind of looking at, again, just, you know, the state of affairs with me prioritizing Evade and Pierce as a free play, is the Wither Snap. It has Evade, it has Heal All But Thirsty. Um, and it has Pierce, so it kind of gets a lot of stuff going on for it. I, you know, I'll probably take this out anytime I'm half serious about anything. Tartarus Ion. I have two more Tartarus um, Scions in there, but I don't have the four, so I can't quad it. And um, as far as competitiveness, you know, I'd rather work on getting this quadded first. I'd rather work on. Um, you know, trying to get a sculpted Aegis. I only have two Aegises right now. And I'm also looking into um, Judgment. Judgment has evade, has protect. Um, it's two, so it doesn't take that long to come out. So, it's uh, something I have my side set on again. There's just so many um, effects, like modify, like non-combat based effects that modify. So even something like uh, Noble Defiance, you know, you Norm, he was a powerhouse like in the early stages of the game, like the first couple months. Now he could get jammed up. Um, he could get, you get jammed up. He could get weakened, and before you know it, he's stuck. You can't get anything. You can't get much of anything done with him, or he could, you know, die before anything really happens. Especially with one of these um, one cost. One of the one course attackers that come out. Um, one course jammer, sorry. Tezirius, uh, Honorable Samurai. These guys uh, <laughs> put a lot of work in. I'm trying to see if I could get a, um, a high level player that has a Tempest Citadel. If he has a Bull Crab, he might have a Tempest Citadel, so I'll see what I can get going against get going against this guy the yeah <laughs> I'm t I, normally when I see a high attack two thing like this I normally drop my one cost delay I like the one cost delay one delay um, jammer is a lot better than the other ones um, this might not be p hmm. this might not be pretty actually uh, do I want no, this is the thing. Do I want the Arc Nova or do I want the Trampling Anvil? This guy... He's gonna put a hurting on me really quickly. Well, I'll see who gets jammed up right now. Um, I'm gonna go for this one. If I could get a... Nope, no jams. All the jams went to this guy. At least I got him off the field. That wasn't so bad. That wasn't so bad at all. Okay. Wow. Okay. What's this guy? Prometheum Solidus. I guess this must be a one of the box cards. I'm not familiar with this one really. Armor three and feeble five, berserk two. Okay. So I think I got this one pretty much. Probably kill him. He's gonna be a little bit harder to take down, but I have a turn to soften him up. I'll have some leech, but I have all these attackers coming in. Um, so I guess I'll tr I'll try to get a commander who has Constantine active. That's my, I think I think that's the high end because righteous usually. Ooh, it's getting big. Wow. All right, numbers will get you to win sometimes.
Uh, if he had more turns, a wall or something, I would have probably lost this, guys. They were recovering really quickly. Alright, let me see. He might have a Tempest at a bell. Alright, let's see what happens here. Okay, okay, okay. Oof. Uh, I don't like this at all. I don't like this at all. Um. Uh, I'm gonna lose this. I'm gonna lose this. This guy being out, he's gonna mess everything up. Yeah, it's gonna hurt. <laughs> All right, let me see what else he's got. All the boar. This is like the only single fusion that really stays out against the field. And does stuff. Not doing any damage at all. Could possibly kill that one. Okay, it's not so bad. Honorable Samurai making an appearance. Making an appearance. Oof. He's wrapping it up on me right now. I was looking for the Tempest, but I have to see if somebody else has it. I might save it for another video, so it's taking all along. But with the with the Tempest Citadel, the main things, um, there's the weaken all, there's the protect. The evade, it's gonna help, you know, keep the weaken all from hitting you, and the pierce is gonna, you know, get through the protect. So that's what I'm theorizing and uh, that's why I'm starting to look at cards that have the evade and the protect together. I'm gonna just skip through this. I'm clearly outclassed here. Um, so in the new sets of fusions that just came out there's a card Wither Snap. I don't have a lot of BT on my team but I think I think it might be interesting anyway because I could count the heal. It's a heal also. It'll get the um, Spiteful Raptor. Spiteful Raptor is a little bit outdated, but with um, Baracus, it you know it, it gets a, it gets a couple hits in before it goes down. Um, it isn't showing me the quad for this, but uh, I think it's up on the wiki. The wiki, the wiki page for this, it goes up to evade two. I know um, the heal all, but there's the goes to three. I think the pierce is seven. I looked at it earlier. Um, the attack is eight, and I forgot what the defense was. So again, somebody say I had a car like this against a person who had a citadel out. The weakened three. You know, the evade would kind of would get rid of, like, it wouldn't affect it immediately. If they had other cards coming on, then I can't really help you with that, but the evade would kind of, you know, negate the <laughs> weaken that happens. Because I think the protect, I think when I hear people talk about the Tempest Citadel, they always talk about the protect, I think the weaken as well, too. Like, it's, it's just that thing that just, you know, brings you down to zero, you can't attack. It's like a, it's like a sleeper hit to me. Um, the evade, sorry, the evade, the heal all, but there's the, so, this counter is healing itself, I think it's at least 16, 17, when it gets, um, quadded. So, it's kind of like it heals itself, a bit of like a weak leech, I like leech effects, I like heal effects. I don't have much heal in my deck, I don't have much, um, armor in my deck right now. And the pierce will help to get through, um... The protection part of a citadel. So this is kind of what I'm looking at when I'm trying to decide what next to make. Right now I have Malgoth, I have Smog Tanks. I'll probably wait for a Blight Crusher, but in the meantime, I'll probably work on Tazir as well. I'll probably show up by then. So primarily, again, mentioning um, stuff with Evade. I'm, you know, the three. You know, I wish it had like other stuff going on, like a. So I might not necessarily use rush to use this anytime soon. Um, this one's just looking to get beat up really quickly. This is this might be team snapped. I wouldn't really consider it 
writing off what I have going on since I'm kind of rainbow. The samurai is pretty good. Um, evading armor. Yes, it's kind of like a. This is pretty good, um, especially in the all imperial deck. I don't necessarily have that, but it's a it's something I'm considering. Um, Tumbler. Oh shit, I evade, but enfeeble strike ball that could help counter the protection. The enfeeble helps counter the protection. The strikes help. No, the strike not so much, but enfeeble helps counter the protection that a uh, citadel will give you. This is a bit of like what you might consider like a direct counter, but you'd need to have like three things like this, you know, um, three things that have like a siege all effect. And I'm not seeing that much. I don't think you know that you'd have to pay, like it's really kind of a wheel card to have a citadel. It is a big problem when you have the guild wars going on. But it's a really, really card. I haven't seen that much of them out. So I don't commonly come over them. But when you do come come across it, it's just, you know, it's, it's kind of depressing. <laughs> it's really depressing. Um, anyway, under Judgment, Evade, Protect, Jam, not that long to come out. I have these two. I'm waiting for a bulldozer. So something I'm considering as well. This Judgment here. But anyway. Um, I'll leave some more stuff next week. Um, I'll actually might make a video before that because I haven't. I might make a video before next week comes up. Um, this event, it's not really, you know, the first. This is really my first match in it. So it's not really that uh, exciting right now with the cards I have. I'll give it a run, see like what kind of things they're throwing out. Infested Rastax, Enhanced Corrosive, that could be annoying, Protect, Protect Bloodthirsty, wow, I don't think I've really seen a Protect Bloodthirsty effect before, that's going to be interesting, um, Protect Bloodthirsty, Enhanced Corrosive, I'll do the scout, see what kind of sass I get, this is... No, so it goes counter strike poison. <laughs> okay. I think this is a event only card. Make this not gonna be any way to get it. It's only gonna show up for the boss. I this so low. It's just I feel like I just auto this right now. Uh, I wish I could get the, this card. I think it gets evade four later on. It's it's really interesting. It would be nice if they made it available. I have a soft spot for Bloodthirsty, but I'm not gonna bend myself over for it. Ooh, I think this was the, um, I think this is the box promo. If you go all the way to the end. Whoops, sorry about that. I think this is the box promo. But at this point, it's not gonna be that much of a threat. Ooh. Who's this guy? Oh, you're not going to show me. Slowing down? Yeah, my tablet's a little slow sometimes. That's the... Hmm. Okay. Yeah, alright. I'll see how this goes. And I'll uh, check back in with you guys. About the progress. Anyway, let me know your thoughts about it. Um... Like I said, that uh, wither snap. I think uh, I think it might be a nice. It might be a nice thing. I'll also keep a lookout for more. Damn, this guy is so creepy. Jesus. Uh, we're gonna keep out some more evade Pierce cards to see what kind of freemium options we get for it. Anyway, um, any questions, comments? Let me know. You could hit me up. Um, leave a message or a direct message, whichever one. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. All right. See you guys soon. Take care. Bye bye.